So this, if this was me, guys, this is how I would farm up, Dylan. So if you want to farm up all the additional items that you need, the first thing that you need to do is focus on completing chapters one through four. You need to do these as fast as, as possible, whether it's in a group um, or just normal farming. As soon as you're able to complete your GR20 solo and you're able to do, do those after hitting 70, hopefully you can get the, the uh, LOD ring as fast as possible. Level this up. Okay, this will give you um, increased damage when you're not wearing a set piece, when you're not wearing a set. So then all you do is equip yourself with legendaries and then grind up until you complete all four chapters. Because then once you get your set, then you can really start grinding. Now, after that, what you want to do is you want to work on G90s. The reason G90s, just like John said in chat, is the cutoff is because GR to level 90s give you the most items. It has the highest item drop. I think it's 12. So if you do GR 93, 92, 100, 150, you're still going to get the same amount of items. So when it comes to grinding for gear pieces, there's no reason to do more than 90s unless you're strong enough to do the 90s in this about the same speed as something higher. So if I can complete GR 90s in a minute and a half, and then I move up to GR 93 or 95, and I can still do those in a minute and a half or sub two minutes, then just do that because then you gain more XP and you get more blood shards. But be other than that, you just do 90s because you get the maximum amount of items. So you'll still get good XP and you'll still make plenty of blood shards. So I would do 90s to get items. And then hopefully you get the ones that you need. If you're not getting those as you're accumulating your blood shards, just go to Kadala and you just roll. So like, oh man, I need uh, I need boots or like, oh, I need I need these depth diggers because the God set I need those. So I'll just roll pants. I'll just roll them until I get it. And when you do that, you need to focus on just getting one at a time. So don't bounce around. Don't like, okay, let me do pants. All right, I didn't get it this time. Next time I'll try belts. No, because your builds need certain items to really like boost your power level to the next stage. So like for me with God set, I got the God set. I immediately went and did bounties and to get the guardian plans. Then I crafted the guardian set. I'm doing act one bounty so I can get the ring of Royal Grand Door so I can put it in the cube, which will give me, allow me to do this split here. So I have all three set bonus and I have all six set piece bonus. So then I went and crafted depth diggers. And then on that way, I found my rings, my weapons, and my amulet. And I didn't have to craft anything else. Anything besides that is just extra. So then I needed to craft a belt because I needed the Hunter's Wrath. I needed to craft the ninth series satchel because that 600% is such a buff. So that would be the order of how I would do things to grind out and get the additional items that you need for whatever build you're doing. So that's what I would best do. I have builds on the channel, guys. Make sure to check those out if you have questions um, or comment down below. Let me know down in chats. You know, But that's the best way that I have found to grind up items that you need. And then once you have one full set, leave it. Like, Don't mess with it. Don't do anything to it. Just grind up other sets. So then when you get to this spot like me, I have all of my Natalia's gear. I have all my Marauders. I have an, almost another copy of God, and I have another co or a, a copy of um, Unhallowed Essence. Then all it is is finding additional pieces that you need, like certain quivers, certain weapons, ra uh, bracers, stuff like that. And then it becomes making the builds even easier. So that's how I would do it. So... Again, you guys are going to see the sign off. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to drop a like. Comment down below if this has helped you find your legendaries that you need. And as always, stay gaming. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.